Problems with memory, attention, and concentration worry all of us because these are functions of the brain that slowly get worse with age. If you are over 35 or 40 years old and have been beaten at a memory game by a six-year-old, then you know what I mean. During the normal aging process, the brain undergoes changes that result in difficulty with several types of brain function. This may include greater difficulty with memory, concentration, and decision-making. Generally, most intellectual capacities, such as memory and speed of information processing, are best at age 25 and then gradually decline. Other functions, such as reading and language skills, peak later in life and do not decline as much. Over the past 50 years, the field of neuropsychology has developed the ability to measure many brain functions using paper-based tests of cognition. However, most people who experience cognitive problems come to their primary care doctor or neurologist and never undergo specialized cognitive testing by a neuropsychologist. This is due to the poor availability and high expense associated with visits to the neuropsychologist. Typically, an evaluation by a neuropsychologist takes six to eight hours and costs over $1,500. Neurotrax Corporation has now developed a computerized cognitive assessment system that can provide low-cost and readily available testing for the many people who need evaluation of their cognitive abilities. The neuropsychological computerized uh, battery known as the Mindstream uh, is uh, actually a comprehensive but brief uh, examination of the cognitive status. Includes uh, many aspects of cognitive function, such as verbal memory, visual memory, short-term memory, uh, spatial orientation, uh, reaction time measurement, and. Uh, inhibition of responses also requires far shorter training in administering the battery compared with the traditional uh, pencil and paper battery. The difference is that this is a computerized system which is very easy to use. The interaction is very simple so that even people who have no prior computer experience, like a lot of older people, find it user-friendly and easy to use. All that's required is pressing the mouse buttons or pressing the large numbers on the number pad in order to respond. This test, which is called the go-no-go -no -go test, measures attention and executive function. The way it does so is very simple. There will be squares of different colors that will show up on the screen, either blue, green, red, or white. And the instructions say to respond by pressing the mouse button as fast as you can when the color is blue, green, or white, but do not press the button if it's red. So you have to inhibit the inappropriate response. And we know that this type of function relates to the frontal lobes, which is very important for executive function. As you see here, red, so I'm not supposed to respond. Blue, I respond quickly. Okay. And in the real test, there are many more of these stimuli that show up one after the other. The computer makes accurate measurements of how quickly you respond and the consistency of the timing of this response. These are known to scientifically reflect how well the patient is paying attention. In addition to its use as a clinical tool, MindStreams is also a valuable aid for clinical research. The objective and standardized measurements that it produces is used at many universities and by pharmaceutical companies. The Neurotrax computerized system is now recognized as a valid and practical way to obtain cognitive assessment in clinical practice.